Howdy folks, High Value DMD. Don't just give me your subscription, but please let me earn it. Let me earn your comment. Let me earn your like. This is my 100 subscriber special. And what I'm going to do is have a show and tell for you. But before we get to that, I just want to say thank you so much for those that have supported me along my journey. I can't wait to have a 200, a 300, a 1000 subscriber special. I will be uploading for many years to come. And if you don't know about my channel, uh, I'm going to graduate as a dentist here in six months, and I like to talk about things such as dentistry, but I also like to talk about things from uh, my perspective as a young professional, such as money and relationships and professionalism and just general philosophy. So I really hope that I can earn your subscription uh, today. And so with that, I'm going to get on to my show and tell. And so a tradition in my family, at least for a couple of generations, when a young man graduates from high school, you ask for a handgun for your present. You get a present, typically, and my grandmother gave my brother a handgun and my cousin a handgun and, and several other people in, in my family um, that had graduated from high school. And I also asked for a handgun. And I am so, so proud of this gun. I still have it and I will keep it forever. And the make and model of this handgun is a six hour P226 and nine millimeter. And I could go on and on about this handgun, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get it out and then we can talk about it more. I carry my handgun in this bag, this satchel bag. It looks very, I'll, it's not quite big enough to be a computer bag, but it definitely doesn't look and scream gun when you have it on. It doesn't have a bunch of like, camo or anything tactical. This is called an MTAC bag, M-T-A-C bag. I got it off of Amazon. And I like this bag. I'll just go ahead and sort of demonstrate it for you if I can get it on. So you wear it around like this or you can have it behind you like this. It's super comfortable and out of the way. And I'm essentially carrying a full-size handgun on me right now. And uh, I don't know all the YouTube rules. I think you can talk about guns and show guns, but I'm going to show you a gun, all right? So you can have it like this, and there's a pull tab on here, which you can pull, and then you've got your handgun right there, okay? And so I'm going to show show this gun to you. And part of on my channel, I like to talk about philosophy. <clears throat> and I've already made a, a video talking about firearms and uh, in my general... Uh, philosophy behind that but the general idea is I I don't want to have to harm another human being I never want to have to use this handgun at all I like target shooting and stuff like that but I've never been in a fight in my entire life okay and I don't want to have to get in a fight I don't want to cause any sort of of harm or any any provocation okay this is entirely a defensive piece of equipment. And, and so that, that's, that's how I feel about it. I never want to have to pull it. I, I only will use it to protect people around me, my family and friends. I'll never want to use this for, for offensive means. And so that's my philosophy behind a weapon. And I highly encourage everyone to protect themselves, to get the means to protect themselves. And I think the best way to do that is a handgun, all right? So I'll show this a little bit more clearly. This is a six hour P226 and nine millimeter. It has a TLR1 HL light on it, okay? So you can, you know, activate the light with your other hand and there you go. And, uh, in high school, I was really going back and forth on what type of present I wanted, what type of handgun I wanted. And I was sort of leaning towards a Glock 19 at the time. Uh, but, you know, I just kept looking at what was the best handgun out there. And the Navy SEALs at the time were carrying this gun. The United States military did not adopt the 6 hour P226 because it was too expensive. They went and they got the, the Beretta 92 FS. And I just fell in love with this gun. I fell in love with the way it looks. I knew it was a large handgun and it would um, absorb recoil. 
you know, it was an all, it's an all metal handgun. And I just, I've typically always liked weapons like that. And I, I wanted something that was special. That was, that was a nice gun. Glock is okay. This, this was an expensive gun. All right. This was, this is a nice expensive piece of equipment. It's almost like a, kind of like a Swiss watch. All right. Glock 19. It's great. It's a Honda, but this, this is, this is a Cadillac of a weapon. So this is, I wanted something that I could even hand down to my son one day. And this is, this is what I thought would be the best thing. So it's great. It's got a very um, smooth trigger to it. It's got night sights on there. Um, that with this, this light, it's everything I can need. So this is one of the weapons that I carry in this bag. This bag is great because I also have an extra magazine right here. I don't know if you can see, but it's right there. So yeah, that's my show and tell. And I, I love firearms. You know, like I said, I only for defensive use. I would never want to have to use this on someone. And I think in this channel, I'm going to oftentimes include the different things that I like. If different firearms I purchase in the future, I will talk about. Um, you know, because that's that's kind of what a, a young professional does, right? They buy neat things they like, and they like talking about them. Um, not that that not that materialistic things fulfill me, but it's it's cool to um, be able to enjoy some things, enjoy a hobby. So. With that, I will finish off this video. If you liked, if you like, please give me a like, um, but let me earn it. Let me earn your subscription. Let me earn your comment. Thank you very much. Until next time.